Hi guys, today we're gonna check out some lock hacks. Here's how to open a lock using safety pins. Open a pin and snip off the ends. Quick and easy does it. Now let's open one using matches. I'm not retrieving those. Scrape the material from the match heads. Then chop into small particles. Next, grind carefully into fine dust. Secure the lock upside down into a vise. Then pour the dust into the keyhole. A standard match head contains potassium chloride and sulfur. When lit, the sulfur ignites. Then the potassium chlorate supplies extra oxygen. This creates the flame. The lock opens due to a gunpowder effect. Let's try another hack to open this one. Keys are too easy, so here we go. Mark out a T shape on a metal lid. Then grind out the outline. Use a mini grinder for smaller angled cuts. Be careful as the metal can be quite flimsy. Once the shape is produced, clip off the edges. Hold firmly but carefully. The metal is extremely sharp. Next, slide one part down into the lock. Then wrap the excess around the clasp. Jiggle and twist until the lock opens. Here's a trivia question. How many Americans lock their keys in the car every year? Approximately four million, wow. This hack's gonna help those guys. Once the tape's applied, gather the ends and pull. Just big enough to get your hand inside. Here they are. Check this out. Use a pair of wrenches to break open the lock. It's a technique called lock popping. broken key. No problem with this hack. A melted plastic straw will mold to the broken piece.
This hack's useful for cold winter mornings. The hot metal will unfreeze the lock. Take a look at this. This common ring pull problem is easily recidified. Fold a piece of paper into a small square. Then rub vigorously on the opening. Check out this safety hack. He's going nowhere. If you don't have a corkscrew, then this hack's for you. Our next one's great for a frozen car lock. The alcohol in hand sanitizer melts the ice. It's a real problem if you can't open the gas cap. Shave the nib of a pencil into the keyhole. The graphite powder reduces friction inside the lock. Try this to open the door latch. First, make an open loop in some string. Then insert into the door gap. Next, maneuver the loop over the button and pull. Let's see how to replace this cupboard handle. But this time we'll use a creative design. Bend and drill spoons for unique effect. Check out this hack. Fully open the glove box. Then remove and replace the cabin filter. Here's a tip to close the gap on a car hood. Simply tighten the hood bolts. Here's a useful hack to use when a car battery's low. Take a look at how to remove car filters easily. Depending on your driving habits, check filters once a year. Let's replace this worn handle grip. WD-40 loosens stuck and rusted joints. Our last hack helps to stop spills when refueling. Saves damage to the paintwork. Well, that's all, guys. See y'all soon.